smells so good. <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Shanice for those who don't already know and for those who do, thank you guys for returning. Uh, so today I'm going to be styling some midi skirts. Uh, so I have a few of these in my closet. I really like this, I would say trend or I don't know if it's a trend really anymore. I mean it's quarantine trying to stay inside and not really getting dressed anyways i love the length of midi skirts or where they hit on the body because um for one thing i feel like it's kind of flattering you know show off your little ankle <laughs> your calf and also your heels you know um but my favorite part about it is it's just so easy as you guys know like you know my favorite thing again is looking good without putting too much effort in it um, yeah, so I feel like these are the perfect example of that um, because whether it's a plain black or I don't know, just a regular silk um, midi skirt, it doesn't matter. It's always a statement whenever you wear it. So they're very fun for me and that's the reason I have so many in my closet. <laughs> But yeah, so I'm going to be styling those today and then I'm just going to give you guys recommendations as to what, what I do when I'm styling the skirt. So maybe you guys can apply that to yourself and hopefully it's helpful to you. Yeah, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I see you guys on Friday. What time Friday? I don't know because I'm so random. <laughs> I, I hope you guys enjoy. So first, I'm going to start with what I think is the most basic midi skirt I have in my closet. Um, and it's this burgundy um, silk midi skirt from Forever 21. And the reason I chose it is because it has um, these buttons up the side as well as the side slit. Um, which usually it's just, you know, all silk material. I paired it with this yellow graphic tee, um, block heels and bag and yellow bag because i wanted to do some color blocking i think sometimes you know we forget about trends that came before um but i think sometimes you could do a trend on top of trend in this case again it's the color blocking with the mini skirt um to create this outfit and what's great is um what ties the outfit together is literally just the writing in the graphic tee and don't ask me what that means i don't even know what language that is but um but what's great is the burgundy and the writing of the top pairs well with the skirt and helps to bring everything together and i just kept it cohesive with the yellow accessories Next up, we have this pink pleated midi skirt from Zara. However, I did get this at a consignment shop at the Collective New Jersey. What attracted me to this skirt was the color more than anything. I just love that pinkish nude color that it is. Um, so whenever doing an outfit for this outfit, I always use the skirt as the statement. Um, because for me it was a statement when I first saw it and I paired it with this cropped jacket from P free people and a black tank top underneath and what's great about this is that the the jacket kind of stops where the skirt starts so um, the crop jacket along with the long skirt you have some dimension it isn't just like one note you know you have a few layers but the layers work together and this is a great example of what you can wear in spring as well as um, maybe even winter just put on a high boot instead of um, the block heel like I have here and um, yeah I just <laughs> love this I love this skirt. <laughs> Here I have this asymmetrical printed midi skirt. Um, what I love about it is the color and look of the skirt. So you have that asymmetrical along with that animal print as well as um, those different layers of ruffles around the skirt so you know everywhere you look it's something and it's drama it goes from a midi skirt to a mini skirt just by the by a turn <laughs> and i love it so i just paired it with this um graph basic graphic tee and um 
what's great is in the graphic tee is black just like the skirt you know is green and black and then it has that little neon writing on the top so again you know it's using colors that correspond and also more than anything um using accessories to bring the pieces together so that's the reason i paired it with this um neon fanny pack or fake fanny pack <laughs> i say neon fanny bag <laughs> and again what's great is you um use the colors that correspond so it's the neon in the shirt with the bag <laughs> with my nails <laughs> in this case and um the skirt which is just that green and black which is kind of a basic color but everything just pairs well together and of course i just finish it off with my black um block heels here i have this pleated color block midi skirt from alex vanash and this skirt is a statement on its own so the best thing to do with things like this is keep it as simple as possible and that's the reason i just paired it with the black tank top um, black bag and black shoes and what's great is the hemline on this skirt is so unique with like the um it's almost like a zigzag <laughs> you know so i just paired it with my strappy heels so it could show off the shoes and just keep everything black in terms of shoes bag and top because the skirt is already doing so much and i just love to let the skirt shine you know this is one of my favorite pieces to wear because it's just so fun and you know whenever you have on something fun i feel like you feel that way too so you know just match the energy of the skirt guys <laughs> yeah <laughs> and um that's pretty much it you know and it's so chic and nice that you know mixing the chic with the simple sometimes is all you need to do keep it simple people keep it simple next we have this black with red heart midi skirt from boohoo and this skirt just give me romance vibes so whenever i'm styling the skirt i just try to match that story you know it's just like i'm going somewhere romantic or maybe going on a date or something so um i paired it with this black tool top because they remind me of each other you know i'm i'm sure if you refer to my other video i said the same thing about the top so i just like that the top and the bottom in terms of vibe they match and um it's uh i would say it's not typical to pair peplum with um this midi skirt but you could do whatever you want people do whatever you want okay make it work for you so in this case i'm making it work for me with this um you know black tool top with the peplum and you know what i did was i kept it um i kept the skirt high waisted and just put the peplum over the skirt because i just thought it created a nice shape and a nice look but what's great is you can always switch it up. So what I also did was I just like tucked in that peplum to just give it a different look. And this is a great example of how you can literally use one outfit and make it into two. So this is a twofer, okay? A twofer for you guys. <laughs> and when you tuck it in, I feel like you see more of the shape of the top of the shirt, um, which is that nice butterfly shape, in my opinion. That's what I see. <laughs> um, and then what it does is also it shows off the skirt a little more because you can see that it is like the high waisted with the ruffled hemline as well as that little tie to the side. Last but not least, we have this blue tool skirt um, from Alex Vanash. And I just love this skirt because, I mean, I don't feel like you have to be a little girl to wear tool. <laughs> I think it's just like everything else is just another material for a piece of clothing. And um, I love the color of this skirt. And this skirt, um, I feel like, is a statement in itself. So it's always great to just um, pair it. Um, with a variety of things sometimes i do like um like a plain white crop top 
or just like a gray t-shirt because the skirt believe it or not is so versatile and that blue helps with that but in this case i wanted to do something fun for you guys so i did this um printed button up um it has so many colors inside but i just want you to see how when you take a print and just um, add a solid color to it how whatever color that is it just pops even more so in this case it's the blue skirt making the blue leaves pop just a bit more in this shirt actually I see it more than I usually do because usually I pair it with orange but um but yeah just you know using that print to emphasize the coloring of that skirt and um, I just you know finished it off with some black accessories um, with the belt and the bag and um, my black shoes um, just to again Again, just tie it all together like with a nice little bow <laughs> um, and that's all I have for you guys today I really hope you enjoyed this video and hope to see you next time okay have a good Friday and I'm gonna go put on some clothes because this whole time I was doing these voiceovers naked in my bed because it's so damn hot <laughs> I guess that's too much information but yeah <laughs>